So now I have filled the truck with all red shapes. And just uh, as a quick reminder here, let's say I went to shapes, I pulled up a shape, I wanted this shape. What you can also do instead of going back and forth is click on that shape, right click, copy, right click, paste. And then you get the same exact shape and you can move them like this. You can twist them and turn them with a circle. So that might help you also. But for this particular video, I want to talk about putting words and stuff on the, on the truck, as well as adding pictures from the internet. So let's start with a picture. I'm going to hit insert image search the web so then over here it brings up a small box for google images and i'm going to put in video game and then behind video game i want to put the word transparent transparent i'm going to hit enter all right so now i'm going to scroll down and let's say that I want to pick, let's see, this one. So I'll click this picture. It says one selected. I'm going to click on insert. And there it is. So I'm going to quickly drag it up to the truck. Okay, so see how in the back here it's red? So that's why you put transparent in. Otherwise, you'd have all white around it. Some pictures work, some pictures don't. So if you pull up a picture and it's not transparent and you can't see through it like that, then just try a different uh, photo. So now I'm going to make it smaller. And I'm going to put it right here and I want to twist it a little bit just like that. So I twisted it with this circle and make it a little smaller. And now I want to actually have that same exact picture. So I'm going to right click, copy, and then right click, paste. Now I have the same picture and I'm going to tilt it the other way and put it over in this corner. So that's how you can add photos from the internet. Now let's say I want to put the name of my truck here. Again, insert word art. And I'm going to type in the name of my company. Let's just call it gaming truck because I don't know what else to call it right now. And I'm going to hit enter. So here it is like super huge, right? Now I want to change the way the words look. So first of all, let me make it a little smaller. Now if I move it, you got to be careful how you move this because if you move it using this, the middle or the middle here, the letters get squished. Look, they get squished like that. And here they get squished like that. So if you move it from the corner, it moves everything the same size. So let me just delete and insert word art gaming truck. Now I'm just going to move from the corner. All right. Now, hmm. I'm going to put it right here on the truck. So I need it smaller. I'm going to put it right here. But let's say I don't like those letters and I want to change the letters. 
so I can go right up here to where the font is. And I can click on this arrow and it will give me a ton of different fonts to choose from. Now, if you don't see one you like, you can hit more fonts and then you'll get more options. So for now, I'm going to pick the font of this one. And let's say I don't want blue letters, but I want bright yellow. So color fill, bright yellow. And the outside, I want bright yellow. Oh, I kind of like the outside with black. So let me put that back. There we go. So now it's right there. And let's say I want to put a fake phone number. Now I can just go up to text box and drag it here and write call 585-123-4567. And oops, I can move this over to here and I can also use that same font for the letters or for the numbers and I can also turn that to yellow if I want oh actually that's a yellow background so then I would put transparent background if I want the letters the actual letters or numbers here to be yellow I would highlight them and go right over here to text color and from here, I could pick yellow, just like that. So that's how you add that. Make sure that you have a title here for your truck and then it's saving to your drive. So I'm just gonna say truck. And now it's going to be saved into my drive. If I wanna find it quickly, I can always put I can always click on this star just like that. And then when I go to my drive, it will be in the starred section.